thought of having this start to make it a beast team. You'd obviously get yourself on the description below, get yourself to use 7 buy, get yourself some cheap, reliable coins, and don't forget to use King with a cheeky 6% off. Right, let's get into the video. Yo guys, what's going on? King Flipper here. Welcome to another Player of the Month SBC video. Today we have Player of the Month P.E. Emiric Bibiang Abamu. Abama what? Abama Blood Clot Yang. Uh, it's out for a month. Um, it's actually a very good looking card. Uh, it's an 88 rated striker with 92 pace, 89 shot, 82 passing, 87 dribbling, 40, 44 defense, 79 physicality, 62 high low, 4 star, 5 star. Perfect striker type stats all day long. Um, can play centre forward as well. In game stats are kind of saucy. It's a shame his acceleration sprint speed is that way around, but. Once you get up to speed, you should not be able to catch him because I'm probably expecting him to be lengthy considering his height as well. All of his shooting stats are very good. We love that. 81 vision is not bad for a striker. Uh, short passing and long passing is good for a striker. Give him 87 free kick accuracy because why not? 91 curve. Mm. Agility and balance. Of course, Aubameyang is 6'2". He's never been the most agility. Like, doesn't have the most agility available. Uh, I'm trying to think of another word, but yeah. 81 agility, 76 balance. Uh, the rest of his other stats are very good. Just under 90. Superb dribbling 97. If 97 head and accuracy with 99 jumping. If this card had power header as a play style. Uh, 85 stamina and strength. We like it. Only massive letdown is his aggression. Aggression is 52. It would be nice if it was a little bit higher. But all round, very good looking card. And he has some very good play styles. He has the finesse shot. He has the chip shot. Great play styles. He has rapid, flair, traveller. Mm, and quick step plus. Yes, probably up there with the best play styles you can get. That you could like with, with what you've got limited. Going to be given rapid as anything. Flair is great. Travella and Finesse with chip shot. Yars, three of the best options. Um, of course, he's not going to be cheap. Um, it is three segments. This card will be ridiculously cheap if you have two in a week. So that's all I'm saying. Because two of the requirements you need two in a week. Two of the SBCs you need two in a week. So, yeah. Uh, foot bin by now. Price at the time this SBC. It's been out for over an hour. Bids and stops will, of course, always be cheaper. Don't forget, prices do, of course, fluctuate. At the moment of doing this... Prices are quite high because people are saving packs until Team of the Year is fully out. Obviously, if you're watching this after, Team of the Year is fully dropped, then fodder should be a lot cheaper. So, League Oon, uh, you need one League uh, player. Uh, I've got two options, obviously an 82 and an 83. You don't need both. You need the Team of the Week. Uh, do the Team of the Week player picks, please. It's like 10k difference between an inform and the Team of the Week player pick, so that saves you 10k there. And you are pretty much guaranteed to get an 84 if you don't. Then just do 83s. Happy days. It's an 83 rated team. So if you get an 84 rated team in a week player pick, which you should. If you don't, then it's 983s, 282s. It's the cheapest way to do it. If you have an 84 in form, it's an 84 in form. 6 83s and 4 82s. So, yas. Uh, Consider. It's the cheapest team in a week card at the moment. Uh, you're unfortunately, you're looking just under 30k. As you go to, you're looking between 29 and 32k for your informs at the moment. So, yes. Um, Essentia is one of the cheapest uh, 83 French league players at 1.1k, along with French, Asabi, Blondel, Willy, Orban, and Hilaire. As I said, 83 is 200 coins more than they normally are. So, there's already, if once they come back down to min price, there's 200 coins saved on each player there. And Lopez is your cheapest 82 French league if you need it. They're 850. Along with Anesri, Carvajal, and Tarimi. Again, they're 850 coins each. So, yeah. They'd be min price as well. So, there's four of them. Uh, at this point in time, you're looking at just under 40k. 39.5k. That's literally because of the inform. So, if if you've got an inform, you can save a crap ton of money. At the moment, you're looking between 35 uh, and 40k to do that. Do a team in a week player pick. That's a 10k saved. Once Fada comes down to me in price, it's another probably 5 5k saved. Something there or thereabouts. So I'm not 100% sure off the top of my head. So yeah, you can see how cheap you can get this one done. But at the moment, for 40k, it's a lot of money. You get a premium gold pack. So yeah. Uh, again, top form. Team of the week. Uh, again, you've got an option. Um, if you're buying a team of the week, 87 rated informs are the way to go. 
Uh, if not, then hopefully you can get yourself a Team of the Week 84. Again, that would save you some money. 85 rate team, the way I've gone is 187, 485s and 684s with 11 players in squad. 32k for your 87s, they're all thereabouts again. There's there's only a couple of k difference between 80, the rest of them and an 87, so DeMarco's one of the cheapest at this point in time still. Um, then we got uh, your 85s are 4.6k, they've gone up quite a chunk. They might come back down once everyone's opening packs, but 4.6k at the moment for your 85, so you've got Zinsberger, Berardi, Salberman, and Trippier for your cheapest. Again, quite expensive. Your 84s are 1.8k, so that's not too bad. So you've got Muller Rice, uh, Trojan, Labotka, Ginta, who ate all the pies, and Fabinho. So, yeah, this isn't as expensive. It's a shame. Again, the team of the week puts it up. It's 61.2k at the moment, so you're looking between 55 and 65k. If you do the team of the week player pick, you save 10k. That's the easy peasy lemon squeezy, and hopefully 85s do come back down uh, once fodder is cheap again. So, yeah, but 61k is not the worst. Uh, you're looking for a jumbo gold pack as a reward, it's a 12.5k pack. 86 rate squad. The good thing is, is that there's no team of the week in this one at the moment, though. Normally, for an 86, it'd be four 87s and 86 and 684s. That isn't cheap at the moment because 87s are very expensive. A high fodder is expensive. Uh, 288s, 186, 685s and 284s is the cheapest way to do it at the moment. There's only a couple of K difference, but obviously we aim to get this done cheap as possible. Uh, your 88s are 23.5K each, so you've got Bernardo and Ryzen, 23.5K each. Your 86s are now 10K, which I actually predicted yesterday uh, while doing this. They just keep going up and up. Milinkovic Savage is one of the cheapest again. They should come back down once fodder comes back down when people keep opening packs. Same with your 85s. They're all 4.6k. you got Arnery, Laporte, Rubinho, Dali or Daly and Freakish. So, yeah. Oh, and Walsh. I kind of didn't count right. So, yeah. They're all 4.6k. Uh, uh, Madison and Martins, two of your cheapest over 84 rated cards at 1.8k at this point in time. So, yeah. Uh, you're looking at 88.2k at this point in time to do. So, between 85 and 90k. Again, this will come down quite a bit once fodder becomes ridiculously cheap. Again, once everyone's opening packs and everything like that. You do get a Jumbo Premium Gold Pack, which is a 15k reward. So, because now, I generally thought this card at 100, it's looking at around 190k at this point in time. So, between 180 and 190, I've got 189k by now. But you'll be able to get done a little cheap. You get 35k worth of rewards, but... Looking at it originally, when I first saw it, I thought 190k is not that great. But because he's 4-5, high-low, quick, and his play styles are great play styles for a striker, I actually think this is worth it. The only thing that really realistically lets him down is aggression. I know his agility and balance is not the highest, but I don't think that will make too much of a difference. You can whack something on that will increase his agility and balance if you want to. All of his other stats are very good. So this is actually a very good play of the month SBC for its value. It may not look the greatest <clears throat> because his four star, five star, the high low and the play styles makes his card very, very likable it looks like. So yeah, um, if you have done it, let us know in the comments below if that's actually true and I actually am right for once, which is quite rare. Um, hopefully I did save you some time and some money. Hopefully the information did help. Feel free to drop thumbs up. It does help the channel and the video. Obviously, if you're new and you want to see more SBC videos like this, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Make sure you got that notification bell on full so you can keep up to date as soon as I upload these. Other than that, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video stream. Take it easy, obviously. Peace.